Ladies and gentlemen, I am Montoya. We have exciting news coming out of Elite Dangerous, my second favorite space game ever. If you have not played Elite Dangerous, let me just put this, let me warn you ahead of time. It is not for everyone. I hate it when people say it's a mile wide and inch deep. You know what? If you love astronomy, Elite Dangerous is a beautiful, beautiful game. You will love exploring in it. Now, granted, when they came out in 2014, it wasn't very fleshed out. There wasn't much in it. But if you haven't played the game recently, get in there because there's obviously wings. You can land on planets. There's the engineers. And yesterday, for the first time, and this is so exciting, especially for you Elite Dangerous guys, I'm so jealous. The Thargoid alien race was discovered, or rather... The alien race discovered the poor, guy, the poor guy that pulled out of hyperspace. Now, let me set up the clip for you. Okay, actually, before that, for the longest time now, players... Now, see, this, this is beautiful, and I, hats off to Elite Dangerous devs, because they've been leaving breadcrumbs all over the place for a long, long time. Players have been discovering crash sites. Uh, let me pull one up there for you. Uh, crash sites just like this. You'd be flying around, there'll be something on a planet, you go check it out, and it's a crash ship, but with no sign of what happened. And then, one day, someone actually found a crashed alien spaceship. This was big news and Elite Dangerous. Very exciting stuff, because there was no evidence of alien life until that time. Okay, there were the barnacles, but intelligent alien life. Are the barnacles intelligent? I don't know. But intelligent alien life, they found the ship. Amazing stuff. So for the longest time, the player base has been theorizing about Thargoids. But yesterday, it finally happened. Now, let me set up this clip for you, and let me just explain ahead of time. First of all, turn up your sound or put on some good headphones because Elite Dangerous has the most beautiful sound design in any game I have experienced. The sound engineers, the audio engineers, Elite Dangerous, good work. It is beautiful. So crank up the audio or put up some headphones, and what you're going to see is a player flying in what looks to be an ASP Explorer. It's an exploration ship. He's jumping from point A to point B, going through hyperspace like he usually does, either transporting or searching for something. And what's going to happen, he's going to get pulled out of hyperspace. Now, the only way to get pulled out of hyperspace until now used to be if someone interdicts you. Now, he's not being interdicted by another player. He's going to get pulled out by an alien ship. This is how they introduced the Thargoid. It is beautiful. Until today, there was no other way to get pulled out. And uh, also, you'll note that his power gets turned off. His ship gets powered down. And with no life support, you'll notice little ice crystals forming up on the inside of the cockpit. Beautiful touch. All right, so without further ado, here we go. Elite Dangerous introducing the Thargoids for the first time. Watch and enjoy.
Oh, so good. Oh, I, I'm going to watch that again myself. I just love the, the audio of it. And the, what an experience, you know. You can just tell that guy was probably crapping himself the first time it happened. But uh, this makes me very excited also for Star Citizen. Uh, I really hope we have this kind of experience in Star Citizen where you'll be flying around and you'll something will happen, which is totally unexpected. Also... Uh, as far as Elite Dangerous goes, this was the first example that I know of of a scripted event happening in the game in this way. So the game's coming along very well, and uh, you know I'm really jealous for the the hardcore Elite Dangerous players to have this experience. Very cool stuff. Congrats, guys! Enjoy. Why, hello there! Do you enjoy these videos? Be sure to drop a comment below and subscribe. Also, hit the like button because everyone says that in the videos for some reason. I don't know why. I'm assuming you like the video. If you don't like it, then don't like it. Anyway, <laughs> thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.